Okay, class, you may begin your test now. Lord, please help me with this test. Got my hands. Please, Lord. I'm so ready for an A. Wait, what? We need an urgent meeting now. principal wasn't playing around at all. He made that very clear just as soon as the first midterm came along. During the last few weeks, none of them had done anything about the ambassador's project, and that had adversely affected their grades. Now Jennifer had made a move in order to bring her grade up and bring the team together. Okay, so here's the thing. The principal said that this is going to be a group grade, which means everyone holds accountable. We're all in this together. So you mean like teamwork? Sounds epic! No, Dylan, it's not epic, and I'll tell you why. It goes the other way around, too. If one person fails, we're all affected, just like we are now. So that's, that's kind of like easy, right? We can just take turns to do whatever he wants. Not really. He wants us to do this every day. But how could he know if we... Because you're going to report it here. I'm not writing in a journal. It is pink. It's not a diary. It's a journal. Wait, wait. I am pretty sure he did not say any of this the first time. Look, when I asked for more details, he said this would be part of the assignment to keep track. Of course you had to ask. It needed to be done. I don't want to miss any other detail. My grades are suffering enough. You know how bad this looks on college applications? I don't really care, to be honest. Does it really affect your college admissions? Trust me, it does. So, are we all going to have journals? I'm not trying to be picky, but I really like that one. Yeah, I'll give you yours in a minute. But before that, there's something else. What is this? I took the time to write down some actions that you can do in your daily routine. With this, we all have a big chance to pass this class. You're welcome. Oh, wait. What is, what is this? And who is Will? Why do I have to take care of him? Dude, I'm not even in your class and I know who that is. Um, wheelchair guy. Oh, Will Wheel! Oh yeah, I know that guy. Uh -huh. I guess so. Yeah, but... Nah, man, I don't... Why, why don't you take care of him? He's a loony, man. I have enough stuff to do. Don't be a crybaby about it. Everyone has their own tasks. Be thankful you only have that. Mm. He only has one duty. But, like, what am I even supposed to do? Polish his little chariot? Figure it out yourself, but we can all agree he needs help. Okay, I mean, does anyone want to exchange lists? Okay, well, how about this one, at least? Princess Diary. Okay guys, remember, we're going to have the principal's henchmen watching over us at all times. Tasks had been assigned. Now it was time to see if the five ambassadors were ready to take this seriously and start working diligently on it. Jake was not happy about his assignment at all. And he really didn't like Will. Hey, is, is anybody there? 
Hey, I need, I need some help. He did everything he could to avoid him. He figured out that perhaps as long as the henchmen saw him doing good somewhere else, that would be mm, good enough. I was, uh, uh, the trash. Woo! Hi. Doing a good work. This way, Jake tried to manage on working his part of the project, or so it seemed. Every time he saw a henchman, it was ambassador time for him. Oh, hey, hey, you all right? You need, you need help? Where, where, okay. where, where are these going? These are going to the library. Oh, yeah, no, hey, just don't worry about it. I got it. Okay. I got you. Just, okay. you go off. Okay, thank I got these for you, no problem. No problem at all. Oh, yeah, these are, they, uh, okay, I got it. Here you go. And so far, he was able to go along with it. See you. For Jennifer, things were a little easier. She was kind of excited to mix the ambassador's project with her life encounter project. So trying new things while helping wasn't hard for her at all. She had a long part of her list to go. And now, with her new inspiration wall, she was on her way to finding her passion. Sadly, enough for her, there was a thin line between helping and being helpful. Blue Mountain Academy, how can I help you? Oh yeah, that's an easy fix. Okay, so you want to go to the page and then click the button. No, no, not not that button. The go go back. No, um, not not that button. Uh, hold, please. Um. Oh, are you here for the new offer? What new offer? For every juice you buy, you get a free sweater. Oh, wow! Let's go get another one, then. Even when she tried her best to follow instructions... Have a good day. It didn't always work out all the time the way she thought it should. Did you just give away a free hoodie? Yeah, that's what the sign says. No, no, no. It's, it's a free juice, not a free hoodie. So you're supposed to give a free juice away, not the other way around. But she tried. Can we see the pictures? Yeah, sure. And tried. And tried. She tried so many things. By the end of that week, she was feeling even worse than when she had started. She had given everything a chance, but still, she felt that she was not suitable for this situation. Jennifer was starting to lose her motivation. And looking at Camilla so calm and relaxed about her future, well, that didn't help much either. <laughs> Melissa was also trying to do something new about her part in the ambassador's project, but to be honest, she didn't know where or how to start. To her, everything looked settled and fine without her. She was just not needed. I mean, BMA was doing just fine without her help. So are you ready for that fettuccine pasta? I heard that they're going to give it tonight for lunch. Really? That sounds good. Yeah, but we're to hurry up or the land's going to kill us. <laughs> Mm, 
You want to help there? Yeah, I should. I guess the fettuccine can wait. Let's hurry. Maybe we'll make it in time to get some fettuccine. Hey, why did you want to help? Do you mean? Oh, it's okay. Never mind. Let's go eat. I'm hungry. As usual, that afternoon, all the students, everyone in their respective dorms, held an amazing Vesper worship. It is during these daily devotionals that students sing, pray, and listen to the messages given by the deans or the students in charge. It's a time where everybody disconnects from school and connects with God. For Eddie, getting things done was super easy. He had friends and people who owed him some favors, so he was smart enough to make them work in his place. That way he accomplished his own work without sweating even a drop doing it. It's lunchtime now, and all the students gather in the calf to enjoy their meals while having a good time with their friends and classmates. It's always a pleasant time. Bro, your GPA is so low right now, bro. I've never felt this smart in my life. You know, everyone has their ups and downs, and it just matters how you get back up. Just keep it as a lesson, okay? That's, I did it for you guys. Well, at least you're not the only one doing so bad. I heard other people aren't doing so well either. Some other people are just dumb. Well, I heard Trevor, Dustin, Lindsay, and uh, Zoe's friend aren't doing so well either. Who? Yeah, Trevor, Dustin, you, so Zoe's friend? Yeah, I don't know. Anna, I suppose. I don't really know her name. She's new. I feel sad for her. It's the first quiz and she's already the dumbest girl in the class. Okay, don't say it like that, please. You can be a lot nicer, okay? I mean, he just said I won't. Back to the point. Is she really doing bad on her grades? Yeah, as sure as tomorrow is Wednesday. Bro, tomorrow's Thursday. It was at this moment when Eddie realized that perhaps he had just gotten the biggest idea of his entire life. It was true. His romantic techniques weren't helping him at all. But if the information was correct, perhaps his intellectual abilities might. For Dylan, the Ambassador's project was nothing but fun. He enjoyed helping others, and this was the perfect task for him. Hey, I just got back from organizing the gym, and man, some of those things were super heavy. And I feel like I got some muscle from it. You see this? Oh, oh really? Yeah. You see, I'm known as the rocket, because before I'm even launched, I'm smoking. I'm, you know, the rocket. It's smoking. Anyways, you got anything else for me to do? So far, Dylan had been helping the leadership boys. Everything that needed a fix in the dorm, well, he jumped right in and did it. Benjamin, the head of the leadership department, never quite understood why he offered himself to do such hard work.
Don't you get tired? I mean, you worked so hard today. Man, take rest. Enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you very much for your help, but I think we can manage it on our own. I'm a hard worker. You see, have you ever told you about the story whenever I helped my uncle build his garage? Now, I think it's interesting, but I think the other guys need to work too. Why don't you go study or, you know, pay, play ping pong downstairs? I'm sorry, but I, I really want to help. I don't charge. Hmm. Well, if you do insist, uh, I got something for you. What if you go around the dorm and knock on people's doors and see if they need any help? All right, sounds good. <laughs> that kid is so enthusiastic. And so the night went. The ambassador's project was starting to take flight and little by little, they started making the project their own. Dear Diary, I'm so thankful to be around such nice people. These days, I did my best to help them and they seemed very happy about it. I helped with the daily tasks at the dorm and the head RA could give proof of that. He's a really nice guy. You should really meet him. I'm happy with this project and I can get closer to other people and make new friends. Helping others is not as easy as it seems, but I'm happy I was able to pull out some things. It was thanks to my friend Erica, who's not afraid of anything and is always ready to act. I think she can be a really good help on this project. Today was my first week helping in different departments. I learned a lot of new things, but also made a lot of mistakes. I really hope that I can start learning and liking these activities more and more. I guess time will help me improve. Hopefully. Things I did today. Clean the dorm's bathrooms, clean the basketball court, and clean the garden. Today I... Oh wait. <clears throat> today I helped some people. Dear God, thank you for another productive day. I'm so thankful for everybody here in the academy. I think being here this will help grow can. in many ways. Well, thank you for everything you helped me do today. Please help me accomplish more tomorrow. Amen. Good night, Tucker. Good night, Dylan. Hey, did you know that you need approximately 2,000 silkworm cocoons to produce one pound of silk? What? Yeah. <laughs> Figure it out yourself. <laughs> Is this my line? Bro. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you fake your cut. No way, way. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so glad.
<laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what? I thought it was new offer. Oh my God. No, I cannot see him. <laughs> Bro, tomorrow's Thursday. <laughs> Wait. Oh my word. You're going to do tomorrow is what? Are willing to. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. You guys are actually like shooting? Yeah. No, what? <laughs> 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 it was over the <laughs> Oh, there.